click the bell icon to get latest videos from Ikeda. Hello friends, today we are going to see different processes which are done or different operations which are performed on a lathe machine. Out of which we are going to see what is drilling, knurling as well as chamfering. So we are going to start with the first process which is the drilling process. The name is drilling. You need to drill a hole in the workpiece. So how it is done? It is shown in the diagram. The basic aim of a drilling process is drilling a hole in a workpiece. So a drill tool can be attached at the tailstock and it can be brought near to the workpiece by rotating the wheel which is again attached behind the tailstock and drilling operation can be easily done. For drilling you need to give a slow feed. So in this picture you can see there is a wheel which actuates your tailstock and there is a drill tool which is attached to your tailstock and drilling is done in a slow feed manner. The next process is a knurling process. So in knurling if you can see in the diagram the tool itself has some kind of pattern in it. So because of the pattern in the tool, the pattern can be easily projected on your workpiece. So knurling is used to produce an aesthetically cutted workpiece which is done by using an aesthetic tool. So the pattern get easily projected on it. So this is a cutting operation but cutting is done in a minor manner. So in knurling what happens is you are just giving the shape or a pattern to your workpiece. So material removal rate is almost negligible. And also the pattern which is produced on, on a knurled object is kind of rough pattern. So in this diagram you can see a knurling tool which is having a specific pattern is knurling your workpiece. Also one of the beauty of knurling is it is again a slow feed operation. Then we'll come to the next operation which is chamfering. It is nothing but cutting the side edges like the side corners of the workpiece by 45 degree. So if you are chamfering the side part can be easily parted off by 45 degree as you can see in the diagram which is there in our next slide. In this diagram you can see chamfering is done on the side edges. It is generally provided to give a smooth end not a rough or a perpendicular end at the sides. Thank you for watching this video. Stay tuned with Ikeda and do subscribe our channel Ikeda.